one more rap jam on my fantasy playlist at uh, number five up from six dmx with party up up and here june 13 2000 there were several editions of this song there was uh there was the radio edit there was the album version of course there was the explicit version the explicit version kind of put me off but still this was such a catchy record this was this was definitely a barn burner and a half a party record just crank up that 4th of July, just crank up the stereo or sound system 4th of July party and this song will be blaring across the blocks and be throwing down, man. DMX, party up, up in here. The album and then there was X. Went five times platinum. Sold 700,000 700, copies first week of I can't talk tonight. It sold 700,000 copies first week of release. There, I got it out at last. Hallelujah <laughs> for Mr. DJ. But DMX, I, I, I marvel. I, he got into some major issues later on. Convicted of robbery. He had some child, uh, child payment, child support uh, issues. He had about 15 children. He was married for a number of years, but he had some extramarital affairs. But boy, this this what happened recently uh, about a few weeks ago. This is this video was done in 2017. Uh, about a few weeks ago, DMX he appeared in court, charged with 14 counts of tax fraud. And this is well tax fraud tax fraud related issues, and this basically goes back to back taxes of 1.7 million dollars that he owes going back to 2000 that were not paid taxes that were not paid 14 counts of this of tax fraud if this if th I don't know how this is going to turn out but if these counts if he's convicted on all 14 counts he can get 44 years in prison it's a shame because he was a very talented rapper. And at one point, he was deacon. I don't know if he still lives, but he was deacon at a church. He was aspiring to be a pastor, be ordained as a pastor. DMX. Boy, he sure came out with one whopper, though. Party Up, number five on my fancy playlist, June 13th, 2000. <laughs> 